So the lights go off at Arizona Speedway, getting ready for 20 laps of main event racing action for the ASCS Santan Ford Desert Sprint Car Series. Pete Yerkovich, Sterling Kling, your front row. Josh Shipley, Dennis Gal, row two. Kyle Shipley, Stevie Sussex in the third row. Randy Nelson, Danny Mathis, Ryan Order, Dustin Burkhart, your top 10. We are set to go. 20 laps, the distance, green flags in the air, we're underway. Yorkovich leads him into turn number one as Sterling Kling tries to lead him off in turn number two. He's going to drag race with the number three, Yorkovich. Kling takes the advantage is going into turn number three, grip on the top side of the racetrack. He'll lead him off in four. He's going to race one and only lap number one. Rocky Silva very slow on the racetrack. Down the back straightaway, he will pull off into the infield, so we stay green. So Sterling Kling, the man out front, a little bit of a wiggle off a of turn of number three as Hayden Grimal right now. Sterling. 
Kelly Clink, though, starting to drive away now. Three, four, three and a half laps to go for Sterling Kling off a of turn at number two. He has stretched it out to about another 10 car lengths over Dennis Guile, but is getting ready to come up on two more slower cars. The 22 machine of a Niz and the 9 machine of Randy Nelson. And Kling goes around the outside of the 22. He'll clear him with these. Guile and Sussex do the same as he brings his car down to the infield at 22. Two laps left for the 34 AZ of Sterling Kling. Now it's going to be Rick Schumann and Randy Nelson ahead of the 34 AZ. This really is your last chance if you're Guile or Sussex as Kling gets a little held up by the number 9 machine of Nelson White Black in the air this time as Sussex once again tries to battle Dennis Goff for second. Can't quite do anything for that second spot as Sterling Clean clears the two cars right ahead of Guile and Sussex, and he will lead them off the turn at number four. Checker flag in the air. Give it to the 34 of Sterling Clean over Dennis Guile and Stevie Sussex. Sterling Kling brings her to a stop here in Santana Ford of Victory Lane, your main event winner, night number one of the Copper Classic. Dennis Guile comes home in second, third, Stevie Sussex, great racing action. It's Pete Yurkovich comes home in fourth here tonight at Arizona Speedway. Uh, Sterling Kling. Back in Santan Ford, Victory Lane Sterling. Heck of a run out there here, doing the double duty here tonight, man. That track looked like it was hooked up to your liking. Yeah, Jeff Walker had this thing dialed in, and I can't thank all my guys who helped me enough on this. Jeff Walker, my brother, my dad, Chris Mears, my uncle David, they've done an awesome job on this thing tonight, and I just can't thank them enough for helping me and not giving up on me. I've torn some stuff up, just learning lately, but you know, we're getting better, and that's what's important. So I can't thank these guys enough. So you had to battle off the lap traffic and uh, get by those guys. You saw Dennis Guile and Stevie Sussex both with his little nose underneath you. What was going through your mindset working through that lap traffic? Yeah, I knew they were there, and I was just trying to get by them as fast as possible, obviously. But some of those guys, you're not sure where they're going to shoot high or low. So I'd rather not tear it up and get through there clean. So, yeah. All right, race fans, Sterling Kling wins night number one of the fourth annual Copper Classic here at Arizona Speedway. He still has another race to run here tonight with the ASC of Southwest Region wing sprint cars as well. Doing double duty, going to try to make it back to back tomorrow night and clean sweep the weekend. Thought your good buddy uh, was going to do you dirty there. Yeah, he uh, he hit me pretty good, but I mean, part of it's our fault. The car is kind of dying in the corners, and a couple of lap cars in front of you, you don't know what they're going to do. And I didn't want to end up like the 33 car. The poor guy jumped that guy's wheel and destroyed that car. So I was being a little cautious going in the corner. Can't thank my uh, my sponsors enough: Hope Givers International, Turzik Brothers, um, David Bird, my dad, my uncle Mick. Thanks for Stevie and uh, Davey helping out tonight. Really appreciate you guys sticking it out in the cold and hopefully put on a good race for you guys. Good race it was indeed. Stevie Sucks coming home in third here tonight, making your first start in the Robbie Allen machine here for the ASCS Santan Ford Desert Sprint Car Series here tonight. Of course, one of the USAC Southwest regulars. Man, look like you have a lot of fun out there. Yeah, I got fun. I, I wish the main event would have started about right now, though. The track's pretty racy right now. Early on, it was a little tough. And like Dennis said, I mean, if you lift at all, you uh, you lose so much momentum. And so I, I was like, I convinced, all right, I just was like, I'm not going to lift. And Dennis had that little hiccup with that other car, and I was like, well, if I, like I said, it's either lift or lift and lose like five car lengths, or maybe just give him a little love tap and maybe get him up on the wheel a little bit. And I think he got up on the wheel, and then lap traffic. I'm sure that was fun for you guys to watch, but it was uh, a little nerve-wracking for us. I thought we were going to crash about every every single lap car we passed, but we all survived, and I uh, hope, the, hope the fans got a good race. So, All right, we'll see you back out here tomorrow night.